Look at me, I've got cranberries in and posh trees. <laughs> going to do a taste test of the new Sainsbury's vegan cheeses. There's about six varieties and I have got four of them. So what I've got to show you is the grated cheddar. You can also buy this in a block. The Wensleydale with cranberries. The Greek style. This is the one I'm really looking forward to trying. And I've also got the original cream cheese type selection. Um, I'm going to start off by saying that these cheeses are made for Sainsbury's by Butte Island who also make cheese and I really really don't like cheese. So I don't have high hopes for these cheese apart from the feta but everyone keeps saying that they taste really really good and that they don't taste like the Tesco ones which are also made by Butte Island. So we'll see. So I'm going to start with the cheddar ready grated so that's good for all those lazy gits who can't be bothered to grate it for our toasty it smells like cheese wish me luck It definitely has that cheese type flavour, however, what I don't like about cheese is it's really chemical tasting and it's really strong. That's not as bad as I remember it. Now it might be that my taste buds have just changed because I've been vegan for longer than when I first tried cheese, which was, you know, probably about six months after I went vegan, so about eight years ago. Um, that cheese flavour is there, but it's not as strong as I remember it being. So that's not bad. I really want to try and melt this because everybody says it melts really well. So I'm going to try it on a toasty and um, if I have tried it by the time I edit this video I will insert a clip of it here if there's no clip there then it just means I haven't had a toaster yet so you can just enjoy me dancing like a bell end instead okay next uh, the soft cheese doesn't have a strong smell. I'm just going to try a little bit on a spoon. Mmm. That's pleasant. I like that. It's tangy, definitely. So it does actually taste like cheese. Um, I find the Via Life one is, is delicious, it's really nice, but it's got a weird texture and it doesn't really taste of cheese, it's just creamy, but it is really yummy. That's a good one. That would be really nice on just fresh bakery bread, that's what I think. Okay, a little palate cleanse. Right. So I was going to save the feta style or the Greek style for last because um, this is the one I'm looking forward to. But the Wensley Dale's got cranberries in so I think it's going to be quite strong. So let's try the feta. That's what it looks like. So the thing with feta is that it's really crumbly and it's really salty. 
Um, it's not very crumbly. Ooh. Oh, it does taste like feta. Or at least what I remember feta tasting like. I haven't eaten it in nearly nine years. Mmm. That's pretty good. And the texture doesn't make me gag. Because sometimes the vegan cheeses, apart from Via Life, which has got that kind of rubbery texture, a lot of vegan cheeses, the texture's like Play-Doh. You know, that's not half bad. That is going to be nice in a salad. Okay. Mmm. That one is a winner. Greek style, that's, that's a winner. Okay, let's try the Wensleydale. It's got cranberries in it. It's, it's fancy cheese. It's going to be good, right? Looks nice. Look at me, I've got cranberries in and posh cheese. Okay, now, I thought that this would probably need a cracker. So I bought some cream crackers up, but look. They're Tesco. The enemy. Uh, pretty sure the cheese won't mind. It's just an excuse for me to eat a cracker, really. Okay, let's cut a bit of the cheese off. That's really good. I'm going to have that last bit on a cracker. Mmm. Mmm, that is a winner. That is one for a cheese board. That would be nice with a bit of apple. Actually, it doesn't even need the apple. It's just good on its own on a cream cracker. Hmm. Well. Mm. Chew, chew, chew. Chew, chew. Okay, so my overall verdict for the Sainsbury's vegan cheese or the Gary, depending on uh, which Facebook group you belong to, is a thumbs up. I'm impressed. And I didn't buy the cheddar with caramelised onions because I thought if I don't like the cheddar then it's a waste of money. But now I wish I'd bought it because I reckon it would be delicious. The feta is my favourite. And then the Wensleydale, that's really, really good on a cracker. And uh, the other two are good as well. So that's it. Thumbs up from me. Go buy some. Tell me what you think. If you've tried it, leave me a comment and tell me what you think. And please subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And have an awesome day, night, whatever you're doing. And I will see you soon.